Normally, I would try to get these products set up before the stream, but unfortunately, this released during the stream. In fact, this came out an hour ago. So, um, yeah. Sorry about that. Ba-bam! Uh, let's do survival. Let's do the hardest difficulty. Oh, there's a custom difficulty now. You love a good fight in a harsh world where people don't much like you and your survivor survival is an open question. Uh, <laughs> begin. When am I going to play Beat Saber? I might be getting Beat Saber set up. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. I used to wonder if there were other forms of life, other people on other planets. I used to wonder if they would be friendly. I don't wonder that anymore. Oh my god. I've got to save them. Wait, what? Ru What is go oh. oh bugger And then just when I thought it couldn't get any worse it got worse Why don't I back up a bit? Yeah, good call. What was it Moo wanted me to buy? Why didn't I write it down? Maybe he already gave Viv the list. Oh, and I have to pick up that headlamp from Peggy. I hope that's not awkward. Go shopping for Dr. Faraday and get the bobby hat. Okay, can I still loot things like in... Uh... Up, Don't you look smart? Right is right. Right is right. Right, 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 right. There you are! I've got a new compliment machine. It's so clever. Uh, pa Parabamps, one year so happy, and after six months, I saved together to get a new PC after my old four-year PC went dead, sitting and waiting for me to get it in, this, uh, in the morning or Monday, dude. Congrats. That's going to be fun. That's going to be a lot of fun. Spiffing weather. Oh. It's been a while, hasn't it? Oh, that's the compliment machine. You look smashing. That's great. What's up, dude? Marvelous, isn't it? Watch out for scurvy. Uncle Jack says. Keep your eyes out for scurvy, chat. Hello, Viv. How have you been? I've got a list of things. I know about you and James, you know? You do? <laughs> Don't worry, your secret is safe with me. Oh, good. A lot of people don't like Irishmen. But I say, if someone can lose that ridiculous accent and go to the C of E, we must treat them as if they were actually British. That's very kind of you. We're not Irish. <laughs> of course you're not. A nod is as good as a wink. Okay. Um, let's take a quick look at our options here. Uh, V-Sync is on. Field of view is like 100. Maybe we should actually lower that a little bit. Um, everything's on ultra. Okay, great. It's actually a little bit better. Okay, cool. I do feel like there's a motion blur on. Hold on, can I turn that off? Is there a motion blur? Uh, there's custom. Is it post-process, you think? It does seem a little bit better. Okay. Some people like motion blur. I'm not a big fan. Noticing I can't loot the stuff around these areas anymore. That's interesting. Just a minute. 
Hit! Roger Bacon! I haven't seen you in... How long has it been? Look, sorry to bother. Dr Faraday hoped you oh, might be done in. with... Come in! I've just made a pot of tea. I really can't. Dr F's got me hopping today. <laughs> you always say that. Are you her frog? <laughs> <coughs> that came out a bit off, didn't it? Sometimes I'd just put my foot in it. She loaned you her... Uh, that bobby hat with a headlamp on it. Oh, I have no idea where it is. But I bet I could find it if you helped me look. I bet you'd be very stern as a policeman. Hey. I'll just say it. You wouldn't want me if I were the last girl on earth. You think I'm ugly and stupid. No. You're clever and beautiful. But there's just something horribly wrong with me. Look, take your stupid headlamp. I never wanted it anyway. I just wanted to see. Peggy, I... Well, lovely to see you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Um, for those that didn't see our last playthrough of We Happy Few, um, our character doesn't play for her team? If you follow me, Kappa Pride. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, it's just nice to be back in this world. This this, this game. Uh, we happy few last year for my game of the year list. Got the uh turn your frown upside down smile or turn your frown upside down category from Zeke because We Happy Few was just a game that even though it had flaws and even though it had problems I just had fun playing it it's just, it's just kind of a fun oh game. shit it's Ooh. definitely good James back. James come in Kill me. I wonder if we'd ever have got together if things had been different. This is all going to be my fault somehow. Oh no! Oh, God, no. James! James! Are you breathing? You're breathing. Okay. Okay. <coughs> Dr. Faraday? James. I feel like I've been run over by... by lit balloons. What the hell did you do now, Pop? I guess you're all right, James. Where is she? I think... I think she finally made a portal. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. There was a hole in the floor, and she fell into it. Then the hole fell in with her, and they were both gone. Well, in, in any event, we, we have to find her. We don't know where she went. She could be hurt. Oh, oh all right, then. She, she, she must have left some notes somewhere. You, you know how she is about notes. Maybe there's a hidden mechanism. It'll be just like her. Where would she hide a secret mechanism? Grab the power cell. Um, oh, pick up the note. Let's read it. We seem to have hit some caverns. That's handy. The basement has become a bit claustrophobic with all my new friends. Dig we must. I better tell Watson to oil the hatch. Don't want awkward questions from Tweedledee and Tweedledum. And to think it all began as a root cellar. Uh huh. Oh, I can't use that yet. That'll be for later. You can take your joy immediately. The Numpty in Chief has me set to do redo 
to redo all of his calculations. He nearly blew up the lab last Wednesday by dropping a decimal point. Haven't been sleeping well. Formula keeps chasing each other around my brain, trying to link up. Oddest thing, one of his formula has two answers. The first is clearly what he wants, but every number has two square roots, doesn't it? The positive and the negative. So while it could be a positive particle going forth in time, it could equally be a negative particle going backwards. What would that mean for the curvature of space? Somehow it turns back on itself? Could you bend it all the way to the place where two distant points are side by side? Of course, just because the math is two solutions doesn't mean the physical reality corresponds, or does it? I'm pretty sure that's the premise of a wormhole. Although, I guess in this case, it's like a wormhole through time. Because the points are spatial. That's interesting. Portals. She was always talking about portals, but... <laughs> Which one of you two numpties put away my slide rule? Do not put away my slide rule. Leave it on the lab table. That's where I use it. Now, please locate it wherever you've hidden it and bring it back. Of course, it's our fault. It's never her fault. We're going to need three power cells to fire this up. Roger loves games. All right, so we need two more power cells. Oh, there's one. Take your joy immediately. And there's the other. Let's short spike the security. There we go. Great. This is the door we'll be coming out of, most likely. Nice. Nice. Gamer lawyer, thank you so much, buddy. I appreciate that, man. Uh, okay, now we go over here. Boop! And there was that in there. I totally thought it was going to be the door. Dear puppy, can you pick up some flour? Barley, if that's all they have. I made you pies, so we're all out. Love, your moo. Those were fantastic pies. Oh, I want a pie now. <laughs> No kitty cam? No kitty right now. Where are you? In the basement. We don't have a... <laughs> okay. Whoa. We have a basement. Did she tell you we had a basement? Damn, dude. Press the button. Okay. What do you think that button does? Don't press the button if you don't know what it does. Obviously a robot. Well, don't I feel stupid now? I can see it was a bloody robot. Why didn't she tell us she was making robots? I suppose that's how she made this facility. But what is it for? Okay. This is nuts. <laughs> Have you ever, in your wildest dreams, ever imagined a place like this? Well, yes, but it didn't have gravity. Did you dream we were living on top of one? Yeah, I totally thought that this DLC was just going to be like another perspective on the main quest. I had no idea we were going to be doing like aliens and underground laboratories and like, oh my god. Uh, this is, this is kind of nuts.
A great day in the saga of experimental physics. At 3.07 a.m. I folded space in the Q dimension, opening a portal. If only I could lay it out to someone who kens the physics like I do. Good news is the whereabouts of the other end of the portal is not random after all. It is attracted to mass, so the odds of snapping to a planet are much, much higher. Bad news, the odds of snapping into a star are astronomically, haha <laughs> Helen, higher. As I worked out after I opened a tiny portal and melted half the lab. Thank Murphy, I wasn't in front of it. Once I found out how to not stick a portal into a star, I'll try again. October 31st. Quite hard concentrating today as idiots keep rapping on my front door begging for sweets. I'm going to electrify the fence. Fascinating news. More of the bonnie blue crystals began growing on the walls the moment the portal opened and then kept growing until it closed. As there are a substance that wafts through the portal or is there a crystal matrix or is there crystal matrix a function of the Q dimension fold somehow? I'm no materials engineer, alas, and if I told Numpty, he'd commandeer my lab. Why? God, she did it. She made a portal. Why didn't she tell us? Cool level design. Pick up ray gun. Don't touch that! Why not? You don't know how powerful it is. You don't know what it does or how to make it work. I just pull this trigger, don't I? Pew, 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 pew. Oh, sake, Roger! Put that away. For God's sake. You're no fun. No, indeed. I am no fun at all. Oh, someone's in a mood. I'm going to go see what's behind those doors. Don't you think we should figure out what this equipment does first? Well, that's what I'm going to do. All right, I'm assuming we can just walk up to the door. There's a robot here. Oh, the radio works. I don't think it's friendly. Could you, uh, could you come back and shoot it for me? Sorry to be a bother, I I just hate to think how you'd manage if, if I was dead. I think we should go back upstairs and maybe start running and keep running till we've gone across a few bridges. We have to rescue Dr. F. What if there are more of these things? That's why we have to rescue her. Something's obviously gone wrong with her robots. Are you sure they're hers? Obviously it was hers. It had her voice. Yes. She must have recorded her own voice for the robots to use. But look at this writing. I've never seen writing like that. The view. What the hell is it? Haven't you ever wondered where Motoline came from? No. From the ground, obviously. What are you getting at, Rog? Mm, I'm not sure yet. <sighs> you do know how to make a bloke feel thick. Look. You figure out whatever language this is, and I'll go and find Dr. Faraday. You're hurt. I'll be fine. I'll go find her. You see what you can do with all those control panels. We'll stay in touch by radio. Okay. Oh, Q is melee. Nice. Whoa, whoa, what? Oh, that's cool! It turns into a melee thing. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. anything stupid and get yourself killed, all right? I'll never forgive myself. You also seem to have a lot of stamina. Uh, what did you just do? I appear to have triggered a bit of the security system. If I'm reading this right, you're near some sort of security room. Maybe you could 
Run the fuck things there! Those marks. This time on the wall. It's not hieroglyphics. I'd recognize Hangul or Devanagari. Sorry, Pup. I've got to go to Meskels. Whoa. Her portals. Do you think the other end could be terribly far away? Like Scotland? What if these are alien robots? Well, it doesn't matter. We still have to rescue her. No, it wouldn't matter to you. I've learned more about engineering in the past month taking apart that one robot than I've learned in a year since I first taught myself. The thing was powered by a purple liquid whose active ingredient seems to be the purple crystals that have been forming all over my workshop. I calculated its energy density at 17.3 blah blah blah. We could use a new source of power in Wellington Wells. Wood gas is so tedious to extract and the wood from across the bridge is hardly free. Yeah, darling. A, a what? Oh, absolutely. Uh, clearly, I will have to trap another robot and teach it to speak English. Um, I still have no clue where the owners of the robots have got to. I wonder if I can learn their instruction set. Then I could program one to do useful things. It would be nice to have some help around the lab, especially help that doesn't feel the need to chat like those two idiots downstairs. I knew it! Motilines from outer space! Where's my inventory? Ah, there we go. Okay, cool. Okay, uh, real quick, my dudes. Um... Mods, you know what to do? I need to run down and help my wife real quick. Also, Seductive Taco, thank you so much. And best of vibes for your trip to Japan. And uh, Parabamps and Nevi with a two years and one year. Thank you for that as well. I'll be back in just a minute, dudes. Give me just one second. Be right back. Yeah, for those that didn't hear my wife, we had an emergency where my uh, my son Rowan needed his uh, stuffed ticker from Winnie the Pooh. So I had to uh, get it for him quickly. Very important. Okay. Then where are the aliens who built them? He has like a, a two hand smack. And the first one's here. 
Это посылайте. of reach. I have a feeling it's something that needs to be charged up. I think I'm supposed to shoot it. Don't shoot a gun at something you're not trying to kill, right? That is the first lesson we learned in the army. I'm supposed to shoot it. Obviously. Don't shoot anything, for fuck's sake! It lit up. It's working! Why don't you cut down listen to me, Pop? I was kind of hoping that you would outlive me. <laughs> What did, what did shooting that do? Did something in here? Oh, 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 oh. We're up to go that way. Oh. After five attempts, I've succeeded in immobilizing a robot without burning its central processing unit. I'll, I will call it Watson. Come here, Watson. I need you. It keeps making sounds, repeated sequences that could be phrases of some sort, some sort of language. It makes sense. The creator of these robots presumably needed a convenient way to communicate with their mechanical servants. I wonder what they look like. They have they have ears of some sort, I suppose. I'm taking a break from the interrogation because Watson has lapsed into silence. I will have to determine a way to motivate it to resume speaking. Oh, I forgot to wish myself Merry Christmas. That must explain why those two idiots downstairs seemed so jolly yesterday. And the cookies. The robots know how to talk. Oh, uh, do I want to do that? Yeah, I probably want to do that. There we go. Uh, okay, we can go back into the vent. Oh, here's a vent right here. Even better. Oh, weird. Whoa. Oh. Hello, lads. Of my ray gun. Ray gun upgrade? Melee hits do more I damage when the battery it's some sort is of low. Kinetic charger. If I oh, swing cool. it around when it's a mace, it'll recharge the gun. That is awesome. So you can see our ammo is going out. I think it does that automatically. Oh, I think maybe I have to hit enemies. I probably have to hit enemies. Yeah. Oh dear. I seem to have made things a bit worse. Gotcha! Oh, and now it's spinning. Oh dear. What's going on, puppy?
that by itself. Of course it did. Oh, uh, look for a lift. That'll get you into the generator room. Uh, at least I think it will. A new kind of robot. Enchanté. Okay, that definitely recharged it a little bit. Alright, cool. So it is it is mailing enemies. any way out of this room. Maybe if I throw this switch. <laughs> oh. I just found a node in Watson's electronics that when I apply an electric current stimulated it resume to resume talking. I'm terribly proud of myself. Now to decode its phrases. Fascinating work. If only I had a linguist to help me uncover the grammar of this language. I'm writing a small glossary of items I can point to. Words for arm, head, gasket, etc. The grammar escapes me. I taught myself German and French because I had to, but I might as well be trying to learn dolphin. But with sufficient stimulus, I think I can teach Watson to speak English. I've got a few linguistic books from the library. I think the robotic language is agglutinative. Much simpler to understand than I thought. I've set up a small generator to supply electricity to City Hall using theo theomodeline. If that works out, and if Scargill Mines can find enough of the crystal, we can light up how the we can light up the entire town. You don't appreciate how much unromantic candlelight really is until you have to rely on beeswax to read at night. No irregular verbs, no suppletive words make sense. Verb tense by suffix invariable. Two forms of we, inclusive and exclusive. Two forms of yes, one to respond to a negative question. All about clarity. No gender forms. Imagine. So, they've got a whole language, and she decoded it. Apparently, by torturing a robot. Oh, it's a timer. 